what she looks like that. Sometime this week we're gonna go look for like a taller tripod because I just have it on this little handheld tripod and we need a bigger one um, but yeah let me make sure nothing's showing in the background because yeah but let's go get dressed all right y'all so change of plans I'm actually so me and my husband are about to go to the commissary and then we're gonna come back home I'm gonna put the stuff away and my friend is gonna come get me because my husband wants to stay home and watch t or watch football. I mean, I said watch TV. But he wants to watch football, and he has this whole little setup. And I'm just gonna finish the vlog, and we're gonna do the ornaments at her house because she has a baby too. So we're just both gonna make the little what they call it salt dough ornaments at her house, and we're gonna make some chicken and shrimp alfredo. And I think that's it. So, I'm about to get dressed real quick. I'm just wearing these flare Nike leggings and then this tan sweatshirt. Okay, I'm back. So, this is the fit. And then I forgot I had these Christmas Crocs. So, it's time to bring them out. Love these Crocs, got them in Hawaii. Christmas socks. Got these from Primark. So I'm about to put them on real quick. But I'm probably gonna throw in a load of laundry before I go because it's time. It's time to get the laundry done. Do I want to get this? It depends on how cold it is outside. I should probably wear a jacket, but I'm going to be here. But I don't want to. I'm not gonna be outside for long, so I shouldn't need it. And then my hair, I think I'm just gonna keep it in a braid, but I'm gonna redo the braid. I need to brush it. Y'all, so since we have heated floors, I guess the heated floors double as like heat for the house because it is so hot in our room and we have the floors on. And it wasn't hot until we turned the floors up to, I think this was on four. Oh, all this hair in this brush. I don't know if I mentioned this already. I didn't have like postpartum hair loss, but recently I've been having a whole bunch of shedding and it's kind of scaring me a little bit because that is just unlike me or unlike my hair. Bring up my part. Oh. I don't know what I feel. But yeah, I'm gonna show y'all my brush in a second. And like the shedding, I'm not tripping too much about it because I don't know, my hair is too thick in my opinion, like when it's curly. So I'm not really tripping about the shedding because it'll probably make it easier to deal with. But it's still pretty alarming. 
coming to see. And I really, really, really want to get my hair cut or trimmed or something because I am over it. But yeah, look at my brush. Can y'all see that? Let me see if I move out the way. This is all just from just now brushing my hair. It's like a, that's a lot of hair. And that is some scurry stuff. Okay. I need to buy some more rubber bands because I'm sick of tying my hair off with a hair tie. It looks crazy to me. I just need to buy some rubber bands. Yeah, I'm super over the really long hair. It's not really long, but for me, this is really long. Because for those who have known me in, or like since middle school, you know me and this hair have been through a journey. I used to get relaxers. So maybe one day I'll post a how I got my hair to grow video. But I won't lie, after I got to college, I stopped. I think after my freshman year of college, I stopped like doing what I do to grow my hair out. So this is all just time. Oh, I'm burning up. Oh, did I ever, I don't know if I finished saying, but we have these heated floors on and it's like literal heat. So right now, I'm sweating bullets because it's a million degrees in this room and I want to open a window but I have a baby so I can't open the window so I didn't have to burn it and I want to turn the fan on but my husband is like cold natured so he's going to get too cold if I try to sleep with a window open or try to sleep with the fan on Just have to burn up. There's more hair coming out. Our floor looks crazy because I have so much hair that shits. But yeah, this a look. This is where the braid stops, but my hair stops like right here. But yeah, so I'm about to throw in a load of laundry and then I We'll be in the car on the way to the commissary. Say, say hello. Say hi. It's you. That's you. Oh, mom's falling. Probably tighten that a little bit more. And then y'all look. 
this car seat has a has a like the sensor safe thing so on my phone I'm able to see if he's been in his seat for too long I named it Elias's throne <laughs> Tells you the temperature, make sure he's not too hot or too cold. Yeah, I'm not taking a picture of you right now. But yeah, it's super cool. So if you ever get a car seat, the one with the sensor safe. It's Bluetooth. Yeah. It tells you if it's unbuckled for when he gets older, and maybe he might discover the button. It tells you whenever he unbuttoned it. Yeah. But yeah, we're about to head out. So y'all. It is so pretty outside. It's super bright. Super nice outside. Sun's out. I've never seen the sky out here with no clouds. Like, y'all see that? There's no clouds in the sky. The air is crisp. <laughs> it's not, it's cold, but it's not that cold. Like, I'm out here in, like, just a little knit sweater. And I'm not freezing. It's snowing in Berlin. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The weather out in Berlin and like Munich is awful. There's still like a little, a little frost in the ground. Can y'all see that? Am I doing a good job? But yeah, there's like a little frost in the ground. He's putting the baby in the car. He probably doesn't need that blanket. It might get too hot. But yeah. We're about to head. Well, I'm, I don't know how many times I'm gonna say we're gonna head to the commissary. Y'all know where we're going. Shut up. But yeah. I might bring y'all in the comments. Oops, my bad. I might bring y'all in the commissary. Oh, now the seat. The seat is cold. Let me see if I can prop y'all up here. I could probably prop y'all up here if my camera's not on the tripod. Oh, they got brown out. But yeah, yellow and brown come weekly, but the blue and the black come like once a month, it seems like. Blue is for like paper and like cardboard boxes and stuff. And black is for stuff like, what, bathroom ways, diapers go in black. And just stuff like that. And that comes like once a month. I'm gonna make sure I have my cat. Mm -hmm. Yep. Hey. But yeah. Oh, you what you talking about? But yeah, so we're just going to pick up a few items. I'm probably going to look up the recipe for the salt salt and dough or dough, whatever, ornaments. But yeah, so the little lady walking in the middle of the street, that is insane to me. Alright y'all, I'm going to give you a quick little grocery haul. I won't restock the um I won't restock the whatever we need restock with y'all because I'm pressed for time but I will give y'all a little haul while I put the stuff away. Alright, so to start off. These are my husband's favorite chips in the world. He could finish this bag in a day. We got some little Krispy Kreme donuts or donut holes. This is just a BS grocery haul. We didn't get anything substantial. My favorite cookies in the world. Love those. Some brown sugar. Put this over here so I don't forget. Um, some Parmesan because we're making Alfredo tonight at my friend's house. We got some new lotion for my son because, I don't know, I don't think the lotion we're using is really moisturizing him for real. Um, next up, I'm going to take this out. Okay. Got some alka sauce. We got flour. I'm taking that to my friend's house too for the ornament. We got some gluten-free Oreos. Don't ask me why. Why you daddy put the clothes back on? And then... 
and then replaced my coffee creamer. And I got three of these. These are the best little sodas ever. Champagne cola, or I think it's champagne cola, but it says cola champagne. I think these are Caribbean, but they're really good. I'm probably gonna open one now. Y'all, I got this little opener from, so out here it's called TK Maxx, but TJ Maxx, I got this from there. And I'd be using the mess out of it. So easy. Love that. But yeah, I'm gonna pack a bag for my baby and pack a bag for me. I'm not staying the night. I'm just packing stuff for just in case. Yeah. He's staring at me. But yeah. I'm gonna do that real quick because they're on their way to come get me. I think I'm gonna start feeding him. Or I'm gonna feed him when I get over there. But yeah. Uh, and he just moved up in size two diapers. That makes me wanna cry. But. Hey. Hi. Yeah. But yeah, so I'll see you at Key's house. I'm at my friend's house. I'm about to make some chicken and shrimp alfredo. And I'm watching baddies. Well, we're watching baddies. So, that's a real bitch. I'll show y'all what I'm trying to do. At least you be honest. The fuck? Do these bitches on this show got to. Alright, y'all. This be alfredo. Real good, real good. Okay, we're gonna eat and then we're gonna. <laughs> we're gonna uh, <laughs> make the little ornaments. All right, y'all. So my Fashion Nova packages finally came in. So I'm gonna give y'all a little, a little clothing haul, and then I'm gonna show y'all some of the stuff I got, like. I was pregnant that I haven't worn yet and because I need to try it on anyway so yeah all right y'all I'm starting out with the shoes let me see if I can get a better angle I'm starting out with the shoes I got these loafers super cute I got them in an eight and a half and then I got these rain boots I sized up in the rain boots I probably could have got an eight and a half but I got a nine I normally wear seven and a half for eight but i don't know something just told me to size well the reviews told me to size up but yeah got these super cute and they're comfy feel good to walk in yeah all right i'm gonna try the clothes on first or well now not first okay y'all so the first thing i'm showing y'all is the on my way active set and i got it in orange and in an extra small it's completely see-through so covering up you can see my bra through it but yeah i mean if you like a little see-through vibe by all means but i mean probably with the right underwear it's cute because i like the way it fits i like the way it fits super cute it's seamless you know I like it. I like the color. And yeah, I'm gonna try on all my active wear first. Okay, now this is the fighter ribbed active legging and the effortless Orpheus rib seamless bra top. Super cute in hot pink. And they're both in an extra small. Now, could I have gotten a small? Yes, yes, I very much so could have. Because I am three months postpartum so i could have i could have sized up and it's about ankle length um five four and some change but yeah let me see if i come back here i don't think it's see-through i can't see through it that's what it looks like yeah super cute oh didn't need to do that super cute supportive i like it Okay, this is the effort, same top as the last one, and then this is the effortless Zeus hot shorts, I think, in sage. Yeah, super cute. 
also in an extra small also could have got a small but you know the extra small just sucks you in and then the little sports bra comes with little pads in it i'll probably take these out whenever i wear them for real for the first time actually i won't take them out because i breath i breastfeed now so I kind of need the pads and I need to stop trying to take them out every chance I get. So, who y'all getting all this spandex on and off is a lot, but this is the, this is probably my favorite set. This is the Vital Goddess Long Sleeve and the same name, Vital Goddess Active Legging in black. I guess it's black, it's really gray. It's like dark gray, has thumb holes, love that. Super cute, no padding. It's pretty long for me or on me. But yeah, love these seamless. And yeah. And then I have one more active set to try on. Okay, now hear me out. I had a vision. I had a vision. I really want to go to Pilates. And this this set gave Pilates. And I'm wearing my shorts over my leggings because they're a little, they're a little much. The top is a little much too, so just fair warning for everyone watching. Okay, super stinking cute. I don't know what they call it. It's called the Fitness Babe three piece set, also in an extra small, but I could have got a small because these aren't the size that they used to be. But yeah, super cute. I just feel like a little high pony. And some Pilates or something. So cute. Okay, now I'm gonna try on real close. Mm -hmm. Okay, y'all, a little disclaimer. Let me, this is why I get stuff in an extra small because sometimes smalls are just too loose for me. This is the tangled up rib turtleneck tank. And okay, it looks good, it looks fine. But like this part is super loose. I don't like that. But yeah, I like this. It's cute. And then these leather pants, it's in a small. I don't know if I already said that. But these leather pants are the Sammy high rise pants in a medium. I got these in a medium because one thing I don't play about is Fashion Nova sizing. So I always look at the reviews and then all the reviews set size up. So I got these in a medium and they fit perfectly. They don't like squeeze into my waist. They look good on the back. Super cute. And these are the only pants I bought, so I'm just gonna keep these on for the rest of the haul. I'll be back. Okay, y'all, this I completely meant to order in a medium. I ordered it in an extra small. And by no means am I tall, but I'm lanky. So my arms are long, and I just don't like the way that's hitting me. No, I like when my like sweaters and outerwear and stuff is baggy. I don't really like the way this looks. But yeah, I definitely meant to order this in a medium. And I ordered it in an extra small. But if you like it, the tag go. It's the for the record quarter zip sweater. Super cute and an extra small. That's what extra small looks like. And I have the freaking wingspan of an NBA player. All right, this sweatshirt I got in a medium. It is the uh, Promenade Dates. Promenade Dates sweater in gray in a medium. And I got it in a medium because I knew it was going to be super cropped. I didn't want it to be that cropped, so I sized up. Because you can see my bra when I lift my arms. So I gotta be mindful of that if I wear this out. But yeah, I like it. And see, this is how I like my sweaters to fall on my hands. But yeah. Next. Okay, I've worn this already. It's the You're My Safe Space sweater in black. And I won't lie. I washed it. Maybe don't dry it. Maybe let it air dry. Because it was down to my hands. And now it's not. And now it looks kind of stupid. Yep, it's super cropped. I probably should have got this in a medium. 
you know, be a stupid shirt. Okay, and then this is the Leyland sweater in lime. And I've worn this already too. And I washed it and it washed well. It's in a small, so I expected it to fall at the wrist the way it does. But this is my last sweater. And then the last two items I have are coats. So. All right, y'all, this is the Downtown Girl Bomber Jacket in black. It's in a size small. Probably should have got it in a medium. Oof. How? Okay, this is for like, maybe if I wear a crop top because my sleeves for my sweater, right here. And have y'all ever worn, worn a coat that like fit you perfectly? Like every time you do this, it like, brings your neck and stuff up that's what it does i'm burning up but yeah i got this see got it in a small but it's super cute i love it so i'll save this for whenever i wear like a crop top or something and the sleeves are lined with the sherpa material super warm it smells like how fashion nova leather smells if you know you know and then I got a trench coat because I want one. My head looks insane. I got a trench coat. It's the it's the Upper East Side coat. And I got it in medium because I want to be able to wear a hoodie or a sweatshirt under it. And it fits perfect. I can tell by the first arm. Love, love, love it. Is that pockets? Yeah, and they're deep. Love that. Super cute. Does it have a strap? No. Can I close it? Okay. Well, it's just a it's just a coat then. Does it have a little belt and you can't button it? So. And it has this like what is that? I don't know what that material is, but that's what's in the arms. But yeah, that's it for my little fashion yoga haul. I have a sheen package coming in and I got one the other day. So I'll probably give y'all a sheen primark and then it's the store called Tally Tally Wage. Tally, I don't know, it's Swedish. Can't pronounce it, but I'll probably give a collective haul of that. This haul is just for filler for this vlog because I missed a few days. And that's okay but yeah that's my little haul and i know i was supposed to make those little salt don't let me take this sweater off hold on i can't focus but yeah y'all like i was saying i was supposed to make some cute little salt dough ornaments with my baby's footprint and handprint but i don't think i can follow instructions so i'm gonna have to table that for another day because it was late and today i've really just been lazy y'all the weather's been so bad and yeah let me show y'all what it looked like outside today show y'all on snapchat snapchat oh just kidding let me show y'all on instagram mm -mm -mm. this is what it looked like outside today snowing my nerves have been through the roof all day because my husband had to go to work today and my baby was at the cdc because we're trying to get him used to it but y'all he's not going tomorrow if it still looks like that what to say rocon is amber that's better than so earlier the rocon was red and rocon is like the road conditions and it was red earlier, and I was like, oh, hell no. And so they let my husband go early. But now it's amber. And amber isn't as bad as red. But amber's still bad, because normally it's green. Amber is too close to red. So, yeah. I don't think my baby's going to go. We'd be saying go to school. He's not going to school tomorrow. Because I'll be doggone if he got my baby out there in the snow. He probably has to go to work tomorrow. But I think if the Rokon is black, he doesn't have to go. I feel like if it's red, he shouldn't have to go. But yeah. 
That's all I got. This is going to be for Vlogmas Day 3, 4, maybe 5. I got to edit. It's 10. I'm not getting this out. What that mean? Uh-oh. Child, through the camera overheating. But yeah, you gotta go. I don't know if this will be out by tonight. But it might be. Today is Monday, December 4th. Uh, 10.03 p.m. Can y'all see that? I don't care. Alright. Bye. Y'all, I accidentally deleted all the footage of me making that stupid salt dough for the ornaments, but it didn't turn out anywhere. I'll show y'all what it looks like. Ugh. What are you talking about? <laughs> this is what it looks like. It looks insane. It looks ridiculous, so I'm going to have to redo it because it didn't turn out. It's like bread dough. That's what it, that's the vibe it gives right now. And it's supposed to give cookie dough. So I also didn't measure it. So. But yeah, I'm just inserting this because after I left my friend's house, I recorded myself making the dough. But then today I thought I uploaded it already, oh but I did not. And I deleted it hey, off the SIM card or the memory card. What's that called? The memory card. Contest. But yeah, y'all seeing him so, back there? Yeah. In for about but yeah, I'm about to edit this video. Early, Maybe so it'll be out on the fifth. Maybe it'll be out on the fourth. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, I hope so, y'all have a great night. Don't forget to like, so comment, share, and um, subscribe. Really good there, so I got that. And then yep. I got 